Remember, I will never ask you for money. I will never ask you to cover shipping. I won't randomly contact you to tell you you've won. Fred Randall! Welcome back to Realistic Fishing. Once again, we're in the studio. It's really cold outside. I haven't been catching anything. But luckily, I have this. This box came in the mail from Oklahoma, and it's pretty heavy. We're going to cut this open, see what's inside, and we're also going to pick a winner for the last gear award. All right, let's get into this and see what's in here. All the way from Oklahoma. Right off the bat, we have a letter here. It says, you rock. Use it all or give it all. Signed HM. Well, first we're going to look at it all and then we'll determine if we're going to use it or give it away or both. I suspect both. Let's see what's in here from HM. First off, we have a pack of Zoom Swimming Super Fluke Juniors in white ice. Pretty cool lure here. This is a Zoom Fluke with a paddle tail. Here's a package of South Bend 3 Ot EWGs. They would go well with something like a Zoom Fluke. Well, we got a stray jig here. We got a loose jig here. Nice looking jig though. Nice stout hook. Thin weed guard here. So good for hook penetration. Also maybe good for getting snagged. There's a trade-off there, you know. But it's a good looking jig. We also have this Jewel Finesse Craw 12 pack. I assume this is a soft plastic craw, since it says 12 pack. Yep. So flat on top, this is like a hand poured craw from Jewel. Good color. Green pumpkin, one of my favorites. Something like this would go good on the back of this jig. Here we have a 7.5 inch culprit worm. This is one of my favorites. Interesting color, fire and ice. Well, this is Matt from Ghost Town Blues Band, and you're watching Realistic Fishing. Remember to keep it realistic. <laughs> Here we have a package of KVD Perfect Plastics Ochos in Honey Candy. This is a good looking color. I don't think I'm familiar with honey candy. This will probably go in my use pile for next season. We got another pack of culprit worms. This one is watermelon red core. Great looking lure so far. These are great. Here's another pack of South Bend 3 Yacht EWGs. Can never have too many EWGs, especially if you like Texas rigs. This is my favorite. This is the Culprit 7.5 in Red Shad. This I try every year and it is successful for me. One of my favorite colors. Here's a pack of Zoom U-Tail, Chartreuse U-Tail. So we got some plastic worms here. See how the tail is green? Pretty cool. Yeah, great box of lures so far. Great box. Here's another package of Zoom Super Salt Plus in Red Bug. Here's a pack of KVD Perfect Plastics Ochos in Blue Craw. Awesome stick baits here. I have had plenty of success on KVD stick baits. Here's another one in Red Bug. 
That's the same color as this Zoom. Which one looks more red bug to you? I'm not really familiar with that color. Awesome, another pack of KVD Perfect Plastics Ochos in June Bug. I do like this color, June Bug. Still going. Here's a pack of Zoom Tiny Brush Hogs in Watermelon Seed. I do want to try this. Not baby brush hog, tiny brush hog. That's even smaller. That's pretty cool. Some more Zoom Swimming Super Fluke Juniors in White Ice. That's the second pack. We'll put some of these doubles aside so we can give them away. I mean, do more. This is Aaron from Pennsylvania, and you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Let's carry on. Another pack of Swimming Super Fluke Juniors. Here's a pack of Cabela's Walleye Paddle Tail Grub. That's pretty interesting. That's like a big slider. Do any of you fish with this type of thing? It's like a um, grub body paddle tail. That's pretty cool. Here's some Nico lures to try. They look like little swim baits. Hey, Mr. Twister. I actually have a lot of Mr. Twister lures, but I don't have this one. Goldfish. That's a very interesting color. I can almost see through that and see the camera. That's pretty cool. Here's some Walleye Assassin. Elite Shiner. I gotta take a look. This looks like a Kitek Easy Shiner. Almost dead on. That's a good looking swim bait right there. Yeah, cool bait by Walleye Assassin. I'm not familiar with that. Here's some Kitek Swing Impact 4. This is the brand I just mentioned, but this is a different model, Swing Impact. This is more of that grub body with a paddle tail. This is a good swim bait too though. Here's some Tournament Tackle, designed and manufactured in the USA. Doesn't say much about it, but it is a large, I would say this is a mag-sized soft plastic stick bait. I'll probably end up giving something like this a try. I do have good luck wacky rigging this type of bait for larger than average bass. Here we go. We got some KVD Perfect Plastics Rodent. Not familiar with Rodent. Yeah, this looks like an interesting flipping bait. Kind of like a beaver tail flipping bait, like a D bomb. Yum Spine Craw. I recognize this. I've caught bass on the channel on this very lure. This Spine Craw is Green Pumpkin. This will probably go in the keep pile. Here's a package of weights, 12 pack of 3 16 ounce worm weights. You can never have too many of these. These and EWG, you need those if you're gonna master Texas rig fishing. Here's another pack of 3 out EWGs. We're gonna throw those in with the soft plastics. Super Salt Plus Ultra Vibe Speed Craw. So this is another crawfish lure, except this one has little hooks for claws. They twitch real fast. This is a pretty good lure. I think I've caught stuff on this on the channel. One of my all-time favorites. Holy cow, this is not my all-time favorite, but it looks awesome. This is a Rage Tail 
Rage Lobster. I thought it was a Rage Craw, but look at it. It's huge. Yeah, it's about another inch longer than a Rage Craw. This is going to go in the try pile for sure. Here's some more tournament tackle, some plastic worms. Got a few of them. Here's some more tournament tackle. Here's that beaver style flipping bait, kind of like that other one I was talking about. The D bomb. Also a pit boss. There's a few variations and they work fairly well for me, pitching them from the bank. More plastic worms. Authentics. Be fishing series plastics moxie. So this is like a little grub, but it has a ribbed body. I guess you could get it to ripple or put a lot of procure on there. That's what I would do. Another pack of spine craws here. Since there's two, we'll include this one in the gore. And we're almost done here. More tournament lures, more flipping craws, beaver style craws, and another pack of weights. All right. All right. This is an impressive pile of lures. There are obviously more here than I can try, so we're going to give some away. All right. It's really easy. All you got to do is like the video, which means smash that thumbs up button. Smash it good. Make sure you leave a comment below and make sure you're subscribed so you'll see the video when I pick a winner. Up for grabs. Thanks to HM. Let's throw in some weights. We have a package of weights, yum spine craws, they're falling all over the place, swimming flukes, another pack of swimming flukes, some culprits, some KVDs, some EWGs, and some tournament tackle. This right here is a great start to Texas rig fishing in 2024. Thanks again to HM. I really appreciate the tackle to give away and the pile to try. Amazing, amazing unboxing today. And now the show must go on and we're going to pick a winner for the last giveaway. Up for grabs right now if I call your name. Some zoom lizards. Carl's um, 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 amazing spinner bait. Some Mr. Twister frogs. J -j -j Jean LaRue and a G -g 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 Bates crankbait. Let's pick a winner right now. I got so much stuff on my table here. This is insane. All right, 241 comments. Let's pick a winner. It didn't pick. There we go. The winner is. Wampster5698. Maybe it's Wampster. Love the content. Fishing has been tough in Virginia too, but it just makes it even sweeter when you land one. Hey, I agree. Fish <laughs> the fishing has been so tough lately. That's why we're in the studio. Giving away some awesome free stuff. Wampster five six nine eight congratulations you just won this pile of lures email me realisticfishing at gmail.com we'll take it from there i'll ask for your shipping info wompster make sure you email me thanks for watching realistic fishing keep it Realistic.